all right guys so i've got a toro push mower here this goes for most push mowers you're going to have a dipstick like a car and it's going to say oil right on it or it's going to look like this you're going to pop it open like that and uh, check your level it's got a full mark and a low mark and two holes to check it you're going to want to wipe a paper towel or a dirty rag or probably a clean rag, but a clean rag that you can get dirty on the dipstick all the way down, push it back in, twist it just to get a good uh, check on it. Mine's still full because I check it frequently and this one's a good motor, it does not burn oil. So now that it's full, you can put it back in like so. When it's a little low or empty, you just wanna put a funnel down there and put the oil that it calls for. Most of these take SAE 30 or 1030 if it's a Honda motor. I'll probably put uh, SA30 in this usually. And then the check your gas, obviously it's just a twist off on most mowers. Just like this, you got your tank, check it. Mine's full, cause I like to keep it full until the off season. I would like to run non-ethanol gas, which I use true fuel or just run it till it's empty. Preferably you want your gas empty out of it when it's out of season and you're not using your mower Only because you don't want your carburetor to rust out or get dirty when it's sitting around So if you do not have non-ethanol gas, which is true fuel or a specialty gas You want to run your mower out of gas completely and out of the carb just to keep it from rusting and not starting next season um that is how to check your oil and your gas on your push mower. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.